Alright, hi Mike. I guess the actual um, notification went out straight away for this one then, because I've literally just started it and there's people on, which is good. Because, um, yeah, quite a few times when I've obviously been doing the stream, I've had to wait five or so minutes for the first person to turn up. I've just gone back a little bit from where I finished the last stream off, because um, I want to just sort of start replaying this bit from the beginning again. Of course it looks weird, it's an Oddworld game. Oh, that's where the wasps are. Right, cool. Ah, good, Mike. Uh, Rich, even. Yeah, Mike said the same thing as soon as he joined. I ordered the um, pole for the thing um, today for the bill hook head. Now, normally I'd go up there to get in there, but I just want to see what happens if you. Ah, is there a water current that stops you? Ah, that makes sense. Yeah, I, was gonna wonder, I was wondering if you could actually swim along there and have a look for getting into that sort of facility. I've not played my summer car. I know what it is, but I have no interest in it. You do know it costs five hundred thousand dollars to move to America, right? In terms of if you don't have an actual work visa for getting um, an actual like citizenship visa that way. Stingbees probably take him out a bit faster. Yeah, there we go.
will be able to heal. I'm just going to try and get the chat back up because for whatever reason it's done that stupid thing where it's closed the chat on my mobile screen so I can't see it. There we go, chat's back up. Have you dispatched that bill hook um, head today, Richard? I know you said you are going to do it with Royal Mail. Oh, now I've lost the chat again because my phone's doing that auto-rotate thing. I think this is the bit I got to last stream where I died and I just said I'd finish it there because I went over the time I was going to do anyway. I'll use the bees to take out that turret. And then I can kill a load of the enemies to um, resupply the bees. Take me a while to get all the bees back in a moment after using all of them up on these guys. Right, I'll knock this guy down here so get see him out of the way. Stamina's out.
Oh, thanks, Rich. That's really handy, actually, because I was thinking, would I need to get anything for that? I was going to look in the shed and see what I had. Um, but yeah, that would be much better than me trying to use a screw or um, like a nail that's the right size. I got a pole that was, I think, 1.2 meters and 35 millimeter. Um, so yeah, 35 millimeter, obviously diameter. So what I'll do is just. Uh, cut it down as needed, and I've got a couple of knives that are very good just for shaving little bits of wood off, so I won't shave it more than I need to. Right, so I'm inside the actual building now. Oh good, I'm getting some boom bats now. Okay, that's a bit annoying, isn't it, if you filmed all that and then it's not worked because, um, yeah, like the lighting's bad. That's the only thing when I film in the room with the red curtain, as much as I think that's a better backdrop for the videos. The annoying thing about that room is that um, the lights in the room aren't as good as like in my bedroom, so it means it can look a bit grainy on the camera. But um, at some point, I might see if I can replace the light bulbs in there with you know, better light bulbs. I have a feeling they're a weird fitting. secret area up here. Definitely not Fallout 3. If I was going to stream a Fallout uh, game, I'd do New Vegas. Uh, it sounds good, Rich. I'm sure I can figure that out.
problem is streaming New Vegas, it's going to keep crashing because um, Bethesda's shitty um, Gamebryo engine. Has everybody seen that um, Fallout 76 is absolute crap like I said it would be? Probably Bethesda's lowest scoring game ever on reviews, like 2, two out of 10 or something. I did say before what I was probably going to stream next and I can't remember what I said now. It wasn't New Vegas. Because like I said, it's not going to run very well. Actually, boom bats to the um, left hand slot one. There we go. Yeah, that sounds funny after watch that. I think my um, rapier I ordered might even come tomorrow because um, I ordered it um, last night um, then I had a confirmation email of it being dispatched from Southern Swords um, today which was nice so hopefully that will come tomorrow. Yeah, I'm trying to remember now what game I said I'd stream when I finished streaming this one. I might try doing a webcam stream again at one point just to see if a lot more people go and view that rather than viewing the game streams. Because I suspect they might, but I still don't think YouTube sends these streams out to many of my subs. Because I find it strange, you know, I'm nearly at 50,000 subscribers now. And, um... YouTube, I get like 20 to 30 people viewing most streams. I know for a lot of channels it is a low percent, but it just seems very low to me. Oh, 
more oh, crap. They nearly got me at the moment. Go to um, Fud Slugs. Uh, I've never watched T series, and I've watched a couple of PewDiePie videos, but not many. So neither is a good answer to that question. That's getting me my ammo back for the um, FUD slugs. Might be not even be me mentioning it in a the stream then, but I think that at one point I thought, oh, this would be a good game to stream, and I can't remember what it was. Just drink some like cup of tea before it starts going cold. Probably need to sting bees again, don't I, to um, just shoot into a group of them. I'm out of FUD slugs, might as well have put the electric sort of shock one back in. Slugs, which I wanted was I was using boom bats. Um, it's a John Barnett one. I thought it was, um, what's the name of it? A, um, windless one until I look closer. But I read some reviews and people who've got it seem to like it. If you go on sword forums, they all say John Barnett stuff's crap, but they never give a good reason why. So, um, I'm gonna go more on based on reviews of people who've actually bought the sword rather than the sword forums, because they're just, again, like all these places. Very few people in there seem to have any idea what makes a sword good or not. The only, like, real criticisms I could see from people who seemed to understand what they were talking about, they said although it's well balanced, it's heavier than, like, a rapier should be. 
Um, so obviously you require a bit more arm muscle to use it. But I want to use it as like a muscle training kind of sword anyway, so. If you want to look it up, I think it's called English Swept Tilt Rapier. It's about a 39 inch blade. Uh, well, we'll see, won't we, Bullfrog, when it comes. I've had a John Barnet um, flail thing before that's been absolutely fine. My mate's got one of their war hammers and he likes that, so. Oh god, I've got the upgraded slug now, haven't I? Um, that one. There we go. I'll just do a save now. Uh, it does come with a live edge because I bought one which is sharp. Uh, it's 100 quid. Plus, obviously, postage in VAT.
little riot shield guys, I can't remember how you meant to beat them. Oh, that works. They throw mines on you, don't they? Am I right, thanks? Yeah, Rich, it's like how I had my falchion commissioned from, like, a proper blacksmith. Needed that for about 400 quid, you know, exactly as I wanted it. And then you get some sword makers that people say are really, really good, but they charge, like, two grand plus for just very regular-looking swords. So I don't know, you know, what makes. run away from these guys and then come back. Let's swap the other one to Fuzzle. No, I have the boom bat, I reckon. Then I'll knock two of them off. That one I'll harvest. Looking at the chat and got killed then because I didn't spot that guy. Now. Oh good, they, this kills them at point blank range, that's good to know. Changing that wasn't I? Just do a quick save here of the new ammo. Shield ones are actually quite difficult because you can't get them most of the time. Oh, 
Oh, I'm gonna get killed again on a load of quick scene. The problem is, as soon as you go and try and uh, collect the dead bodies of those ones, you get more, start shooting at you in the side. I'm obviously not playing Stalker, am I? Ah, good, I've got the better sting bees now, so let's equip those. I have the riot slugs on one and the sting bees on the other. There you go. Yeah, I was saying that earlier, Bullfrog, because YouTube doesn't send the videos out to people, evidently. Which way am I meant to be going? Turning around there, I guess. See if I can actually steer the boat properly now I've got it going. Oh, not very well. I guess when you want to go right, you actually want to take your finger off forwards and then push right.
we go. That turret's really useful in that boat. I don't know if that can actually point behind you, that gun. Oh, it looks like it can, yeah. So it pretty much gives 360 degrees of fire. Yeah, that sounds good, Rich. Be quite interesting to see all the stuff he could make. I guess I'm still going that way, aren't I? Another gate here. I have to go round and unlock it. Gotta get up above the gate. Find a way to open it. It's in the title of the stream, Bullfrog. low on health so hopefully all these guys are dead by the time I get there. Yeah they are, good. Yeah exactly, if you're making a frosty a frosting only weapon like a bayonet I imagine would work well with that as well. Um, yeah, if it's a metal that doesn't hold an edge, it doesn't actually matter, does it? If you're making a frosting only blade, that would make a lot of sense.
I reckon I might have... Ah, there's a rope there. Okay. Because oh, I was wondering if I'd have to swim through like a smaller section of the gate and then do something on the other side to get the canoe through. as these wall barks, they actually do quite a lot of damage compared to the outlaws earlier in the game. I think like an FS knife, yeah, or a bayonet would be good. But speaking of triangular blades, um, you used to be able to get triangular bladed bayonets, but they were banned by the UN or something. Like you can still buy them as um, an individual, but like militaries aren't allowed to, you know, use them under under Geneva Convention type thing. Because um, on a couple of like the old Soviet things, like the SKS, they had those triangular, you know, like not bladed at all, but you know, like triangular bayonets, like a triangle spike that unfolded and, you know, like, clipped forwards. save here. Um, I'll go for a bit longer on the stream but not massively longer. I'll see if there's a good bit during this area. Oh good, they've dispatched my um, thingy bob. guys. I'll get the boom bat ready actually. By how is the game? I obviously like it, or I wouldn't be streaming it. Not of 
them down though. So they've got sterling or something. <laughs> huh. That looks like a US World War II Navy mask, actually. Let's be knock him down properly now. He's knocked down the wrong way. Need him to land the other way up. <laughs> oh well. Probably my M50, but I'd rather have an M50 in 40mm like a C50. Or the Polish MP5 actually. Uh, that's pretty good. I mean the M50 is overall a better mask than the MP5, but MP5 is 40mm, isn't it? Take out the group of them here. I just need to execute that one. Um, I suppose I could use this last boom that I've got. Go back to sting bees on the left one. That's decayed too much. Yeah, I've got Hearts Fine 4. Um, I've not played all that much because um, I'd have to like learn how to play it properly. I've played a lot of Hearts of Iron 3 though. Let's just see. Um, that's a regular skunk, isn't it? I have a feeling the skunk you get later, um, the more efficient one, has a gas mask on. I can't remember after. See when we get it. Have to 
and uh, some more of Magda first, I think. Fan of Skyrim. I'd, if I was going to stream an Elder Scrolls game, I'd stream Morrowind. I really need some of them to die closer to me so I can get some more ammo. See if I can get these two. I've got at least one of them. I'm not replying to anyone, it's because I'm deeply concentrating at the moment. Uh, I've played one of them before. Like, the, the, like the, not the most recent one, but it was like the remake of one of the older ones, wasn't it? It's alright.
Oh yeah, the whole point is that you put different live creatures on the crossbow. I mean, you can hit them and stuff as well. But... I kill the tank then? Do I have to shoot it from behind? I can't remember. Might as well have another ammo to the problem. around it fast enough. Oh, it does have a health bar. Oh, there we go. It was just a case of shooting it. That was easier than I thought. What's he doing? Fud slugs like right that. Okay, that's filled up on fud slugs. Is there a wasp's nest here anywhere? Puzzles. All I need now is some. There we go. Oh, full on sting bees again. Good. This place is falling apart. Well, oh, strange deep dude. Man, are we glad to see you, Elsa. We need your help, man, to uh, take last lead back. Because we're being invaded. Did you notice? as I can, but I still need to get up river and take out Secto. But tell him, man, there's too many wobblers outside for us to kick butt out. We're gonna get stopped. But hey, if uh, Strange Steve here can get to the city's outer walls and help us get to the city's cannons, yeah, that's what we need to do. Well, let's get going. Steve dude, wait, hey, before you go, take this. <laughs> it's badass armor, and it's the best stuff we got. So go, dude. Smack him up, man. If we can hold them here, then you and, and our buddies will go up there and fight that secto demon prick. We'll go to the dam and free our water, dudes. I have no idea, Bufra.
Uh, watch the older streams if you want to know what this game's about. Or read a plot synopsis on Wikipedia. Can't really describe it easily uh, in a very short time. Let's put the boom bats back up. Oh, I've got the upgraded boom bats now. Right shield spam. <laughs> this place is yeah, let's try this new combination. There you go. <laughs> Gas mask on the skunk. That works pretty well. No idea what you're on about with ghost armor. Right, I'll save that here and finish the stream because that's the end of um, that sort of area. So I'm quite close to the end now, probably an hour or two from the end. So I, if I have enough time on Thursday, uh, I'll finish the game then, probably. Right, see everybody who's been watching. Bye.